not so much paddling as we are getting in the water and dragging our canoe along. Hey guys, it's Alex Haney and this is my friend Liam. Hello. We're back on Canoe Lake. I was just here a couple weeks ago and uh, I'm back here for a bit more of an intense trip doing 100 kilometers in four days. So, and as you can see from the bug nets, <laughs> it's like brutal bug season, so it should be a good time. We're on Potter Creek and I'm just wondering if anybody in the YouTube universe can tell me what this thing is. Any ideas? I'm thinking dock. It yeah. kind of looks like it used to be a wood, but... So we're going up Potter Creek and it has turned into more like a stream. <laughs> and there are definitely a lot of obstacles and pulling the canoe along. Definitely embracing being wet now. <laughs> so we're making our way through Potter Creek here. <clears throat> Not so much paddling as we are getting in the water and dragging our canoe along. <laughs> um, lots of small little portages that we're doing beaver dams as you can see I got absolutely soaked <laughs> just doing this beaver dam lift over right here oh, super cool spot Getting a little deep. Getting a little deep. I want to get that window because it's going to have to get out of there. Heck, let's just do this the rest of the trip. Yeah. <laughs> I'm having so much fun. <laughs> I love this kind of stuff. Well, we just did a 725 meter portage from Potter Lake to Brulee Lake. One more portage until the unmaintained 200, 2500, I think it is, portage. <laughs> yeah. You're gonna get a shot of all these bugs. <laughs> oh my god, your hat is so covered. Well, it's pouring rain now. <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> Check how many bugs are right here in this spot. It's a little bit ridiculous. <sighs> okay, we're about to go across this lily pond and then onto our huge long brutal portage. <laughs> Are you excited? Oh, so excited. <laughs> this is my face of excitement covered in bugs. <laughs> so we made it to the portage, but first we had to go through this ridiculous <laughs> floating mud puddle. None of that over there is solid ground. It's all like floating cakes of mud. <laughs> So we're just trying to figure out how to get the canoe over that log. The problem is, every time you try to step, then if you have a heavy bag, you sink even deeper. So, it's been quite a challenge.
Well, I'd say we're probably about two thirds maybe done this portage. And it's not too bad actually. I thought it would be worse. I thought there'd be lots of trees in the way and I didn't think we'd be able to follow the trail because it said it was unmaintained. But I'm definitely feeling sore. <laughs> yeah, my sure. shoulders are... I could use a break. <laughs> <sighs> I'm dead. <laughs> uh, yeah, we did it. Well, I did it. I'm still waiting for Liam. I'm gonna tell you, seeing that water off in the distance was real nice. I'm feeling pretty sore. And I'm ready to get to camp. Now we're on Craneville, so just a short little paddle and we'll be there. Well, we're at our site on Craneville. It's the only one here, so it better be good. <laughs> it looks pretty sweet from here and it looks good for hammock camping, which we were both very excited about. And it's also pretty sweet to have an entire lake to yourself. Especially one that's this hard to get to and there's probably nobody but us that's crazy enough to come out here in the middle of June. <laughs> I just made hot chocolate on my new-ish stick stove. It's a firebox stove and I really like it. Yep. <laughs> Good? Nothing like hot chocolate by a little mini fire. <laughs> <laughs> so what is this dinner that you've got here? This is Spud Bomb and there is four cheese instant mashed potatoes with bacon bits, chives, soy milk powder, crushed nut mix, and crispy fried onions for the top. Oh man, this looks like <laughs> a lot of food. It's gonna it's be gonna a lot. Be, it's gonna be good though. <laughs> Doesn't that look appetizing? <laughs> if we were anywhere but here, it would look like vomit. But here, it's a delicacy. <laughs> here we did 25 kilometers of paddling today, and we're starving. Good. The crispy onions. Made it. Thank Kelly for that. <laughs> It is 8.30 and Liam is asleep. We're both sleeping in hammocks for the first time. And we're testing them out and then he passed right out. I just fell down in the mud. <laughs> right. What do you think? Are you glad that's over? Yeah. <laughs> so we're both using Dutch hammocks, um, the Poly D hammock, and we're using the Whoopi Sling suspension, both of us, with the tree straps, and we also got some uh, Dutch clips. Oh, <laughs> <laughs>